Hello guys, it's too cool from Public Enemy here with a gold gun video. Today we have the gold M27 IAR. Now this is a great gun, I'd really recommend it, but I also have a secondary meaning to this commentary, but I think you guys will really enjoy it. Now before we get started with anything, Survival Island Part 1 is up. It's on my second channel, Too Cool. Link will be in, in the description. So the reason I'm uploading it to that channel is sort of to have that channel meaning. Another reason you might, you guys might want to subscribe to that channel is because videos that are going to be uploaded on this channel, Public Anime, will be uploaded on Too Cool the night before. So this is, right now, it is Monday, February 10th. It's going up Monday night, and it'll be on Public Anime tomorrow morning. So if you guys want to see that gameplay, go ahead and go to Too Cool. And that'll go with all vehicles. I mean, not all, video all videos from now on, unless there's some kind of change for some reason, but, which there probably will be. Now, back to this. I've got a bit of a rant, but I'll cover that after the gun. Now, the M27 IAR is an amazing gun. As you guys can see, it's beautiful with the gold camo. <laughs> and I'm actually running a triad reticle, too, for being a public enemy. How we want a clan war. That doesn't have to do with gold, but it really goes nice with it. And, yeah. So, it's a great gun. LMG, it's a bit slow. The challenges were kind of easy, but at the same time, they were tough. And that'll kind of lead to my rant, the challenges. I might as well just rant about it now. But, I do recommend this gun, guys. I think you guys should try it out. Make a class with it. If I do recommend, um... I use Stalker on mine, but I'm also very rushy, and I play the objective a lot, so if you're like that, then go ahead and use Stalker, but if you like a supportive and a very slow loadout, then I recommend taking off Stalker, maybe put on, like, I don't know, fully loaded and just camp your butt off. <laughs> to be honest, that's an amazing tactic for this gun, because it's got great damage, you just have to, in a slow fire rate, you just have to be accurate. So, try out this weapon, I think you guys will really have a fun time, and if you want to get a gold, this is one of the better ones to get, because, as you guys can see, when you reload, gold and black looks amazing. <laughs> Reminds me of Black Ops 1. But, I have a rant, and I am, I am mad, I'm gonna rant about multiple things. <laughs> okay, so, I was playing Search and Rescue last night, I had an amazing time, I was like, 16-0, and I was actually recording, and then I s hit stop capture, and it doesn't save the file, so I'm like, okay, maybe that was just a mistake, and it'll come back later. No, I lost the file. So, that really sucks. I went 16-0 in search and rescue, and I was really close to a chem strike, and then the enemy's rage quit. It was, oh my god, it was so funny. I think you guys really would have liked it, but... Sadly, I don't have the gameplay, and then, just a couple minutes ago, I was playing Call of Duty Ghost. By the way, I'm back to playing Ghost, don't worry guys. <laughs> and, I I was sniping, I wasn't doing very good, I was like 3 and 6, and then I pick up a Vepr, and I got on a 20 kill streak with a Vepr. Oh. <laughs> Another chem strike fail by yours truly. <laughs> now... I could probably make a series out of me just failing to get chem strikes, but I don't know if you guys would want to watch that, but maybe, maybe. <laughs> Tell me in the comment section below, guys. Now, I'm also going to rant about the challenges in this game, how I said that there is kind of tough. Well, to get this gun gold, I believe you need 40 point blanks, and he, I, I just think that's like really unfair like it took forever but you know call of duty they have to go ahead and change the challenge so this doesn't apply with this gun this gun is the same but with marks and rifles they changed the challenge from 40 point blanks to 20 those 20 point blanks took me like four hours to get and they just change it i'm really kind of mad about that now, at the very beginning of the game, they did that too with Riot Shield. It used to be, I think, 200 assists, and they changed it to 50. I mean, yeah, that's that's probably a bit more unfair than 20-point blanks, 
because the ride shield's tough, you kind of need a partner, but... I just think that's so stupid. We put so much hard work into it, and then they just change it, and it's all of a sudden, it's so much easier, and all of a sudden, everybody's going to have gold IA2s, because that's everybody's favorite marksman rifle, and MR28s, and... <laughs> you guys get my point, but... That's about it. I might let the rest of the gameplay run out. Actually, let's mine. Let's rant about something else. Minecraft. This. I'm actually. I'm actually done like ranting, but this is just kind of joke. I hate how if you're in creative mode, there are eggs. Then there are chicken eggs. Spawn chicken eggs. Now, if you're in creative mode, you can just wait. Like, there's no need for you to have to for spawn or chicken. Like, that's. Y you guys get my point. I'm pretty much just babbling on now so chicken spawn eggs that's just that's just weird it's there's no point if you're in creative you can wait just use normal eggs but yeah it's feeling ranty guys I feel like I gotta tweet this video at Treyarch <laughs> no but I hope you guys have enjoyed this is gold gun number I believe seven so, let's try and get a like. <laughs> Leave a like if you guys enjoyed the video, and I will get back to you guys. In recent news, actually, we are at 47 subscribers as of this video. That is absolutely insane. And the newest video, How to Spawn a Super Flat World in Minecraft, PlayStation 3 Edition, has over 100 views. That is absolutely insane, guys. Just... Thank you so much. Okay, I think, I think I'm done ranting now. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys have an, a great day. Hope you don't, like, choke. That would be awful. That would be a horrible to die. Horrible day. Horrible day. Horrible day. Sorry. And... Yeah. Have a nice day. Bye. Actually, guys, I am not done ranting yet. I am... Uh, this makes me mad all over again, so I probably shouldn't be playing Call of Duty Ghost because I'm just going to get aggravated. And, and this is, yeah, this is reality. <laughs> but my problem is, I always looking at the links, which will probably be the next Gold Gun video that's not a promise, but it's maybe. And I realize it only takes 50 leaning kills. Now, I'm pretty comfortable with the snipers now because I have the L11.6 and the Gold USR. Gold, obviously. I gotta say the gold twice for the USR because it's it's beautiful. <laughs> but I'm like I know my snipers and I realize the challenges have changed for that too. Instead of it being a hundred kills while leaning using this weapon, now it's get fifty kills with this weapon while leaning. That is so stupid. And if that isn't aggravating enough, get ten rescue kills with this weapon. It used to be twenty. And that has always been the hardest part of the challenge. That just makes me so mad, and I'm I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. I'm just mad. This, these took forever, but now that they're such easy challenges, I might do them now. We'll see. But that was the reason I wasn't going to get any more marksman rifles. All the point blanks, and now the snipers. And what's next for the SMGs? It's going to be like get ten kills and get a gold mtar like that's just how it seems to be now so treyarch i hope somehow somebody sees this video but you should have if if you wanted it to be that easy you should have done it at the beginning of the game i hate to say it but it is absolutely true so that sucks this this just sucks guys i'm sorry <laughs> i put so much hard work into this gold gun series and I'm just, like, flicked off by Treyarch and this beautiful quad. Um, so, yeah. Thanks a lot, Treyarch. <laughs> no, but in reality, I love you guys' games. Keep doing whatever you're doing. And let me try and explain this. I'm going to make this a long commentary, so just pretend that I ever exited the video. <laughs> um, I want to explain to you guys why I left playing why I didn't play Call of Duty Ghost for like a month. Now, this game is I think it's a good game, but 
it's hard for me to play it solo. If that makes sense. I need friends and people to play with, otherwise it's just another rage inducing game. That's pretty much why I can play Grand Theft Auto and Minecraft and a lot of stuff like that without people with me. <laughs> but like somehow Grand Theft Auto is a peaceful game. Like I don't get mad at people playing Grand Theft Auto, I just kinda accept it. And Minecraft, that is just, like, that is so chill. That game is just great. So, that's kind of why this game, you kind of need friends to have fun in it. Otherwise, it's just playing it instead of having fun. So, I'm trying to do the more fun games and, you know, Minecraft and GTA, they're newer. Actually, GTA isn't newer, but I haven't played it before. And these are all new experiences to me, while Call of Duty kind of feels the same hate to say it but those are my reasons hope you guys can understand why why I've been doing what I'm doing but I think a lot of you guys can agree with me at the same time so I hope you guys have enjoyed this is the actual ending because there's only like a minute left I'll just let this play out have a nice day and um yeah leave a like <laughs> bye